a giant meteorite is heading toward Earth, touching off giant landslides, tidal waves, and children in the woods are trapped in quicksand as giant buzzards circle overhead. And out there, a Nazi submarine. And it fires two torpedoes toward the giant gas tanks. And they were running. And here comes a man on horseback riding along the beach. And he pulls the kids out of the quicksand as he fires a shoulder mounted rocket. And he blows that submarine out of the water. The shock waves of which deflect that meteoroid as it lands in the ocean and it misses those guys who are playing ping pong. See how that works? This would cost about $1,435,382 to do it in a movie or on television, and, and we can do it for pennies on the radio. And we can send it to you in your home, avoiding all the overhead of of movie theaters, which means a profit margin of 98%. I mean, where else, where else do you find that? And that's why radio is booming, and that's why television is fading so fast. And that's why radio sound effects men like Tom Keith, like Mr. Fred Newman, are the most highly paid professionals in broadcasting today. Anyway, anyway.